What if everybody did that? Hmm, that's interesting. Looks like somebody's running through the grocery store with the grocery cart. I wonder why they're doing that. Hey, when we went to the zoo, I fed just a little of my popcorn to the bear. The zookeeper waved his broom and said, what if everybody did that? Notice the sign, please do not feed the bears. I just wanted to see how fast the grocery cart would go. It went faster than I expected. When the manager stopped me, she said, what if everybody did that? And you can look at the pictures to the right. I see some pretty crazy things happening in the grocery store. On the way to visit grandma and grandpa in Kansas, I dropped just one soda can out of the window. The patrol man who pulled us over said, what if everybody did that? Notice what's happening in the picture on the right. <clears throat> if everybody threw cans out of their car, there is definitely a problem happening. At Uncle William's wedding, I took just a little lick of the frosting from the fancy cake. The lady behind the table glared at me over her glasses and said, what if everybody did that? And that picture on the right has an answer. That wedding cake doesn't look so nice anymore. I told the babysitter that I took a bath just once a year. As she shooed me into the bathroom, she said, what if everybody did that? And I think the answer to that question is in the picture on the right hand side. That family looks like they probably take a bath once a year. <clears throat> During story time, I had something important to say. I just couldn't wait till the end of the story. The librarian put her finger to her lips and said, what if everybody did that? And third graders, I bet you can make connections to this. Look at all of these children shouting out. I gotta go potty. Why can't we read one of those other books? I already read that one. My mom said that recycling is a very good thing and we in my house and once I, I'm so hungry. How much do you weigh? I can count my toes. I wonder if any learning is happening in that library right now. While we sat in the car waiting for dad, I honked the horn. I just honked a few times, but Mr. Thompson came to his door. He shook his head and said, what if everybody did that? Beep, beep. And then if we look at this picture over here to the right, everybody honking, I don't know, it looks like this man here in the picture might be getting a headache from all the loud honking sounds. At the swimming pool, I just splashed a little. The lifeguard blew his whistle and said, what if everybody did that? Hmm, there's no water left in the pool. On the bus, I just stood up to see the fire truck. Mr. Gearshift glared at me in the rear view mirror and said, what if everybody did that? And man, it looks like the school bus tipped over. That does not look good. And I see the firefighters are saying, sit down, sit down. Just once I didn't hang my coat on the rack at school. Miss Sanders made me pick it up and said, what if everybody did that? And for those of us that have coat rooms in our classroom, I think we've seen this scene before. At recess, I threw just one snowball at Sammy. Mr. Walter saw me. When he sent me to stand by the wall, he said, what if everybody did that? Doesn't look like those kids are having too much fun in the snow, at least not this little girl in the front with the orange hat. When we went out for dinner, I just shot one straw wrapper. 
The waitress stopped taking out orders and looked straight at me. She said, what if everybody did that? And I don't know if the grown-ups are having too good of a time in the restaurant. Looks like everybody's dodging straw wrappers. After the football game, I just ran on the field to get the quarterback's autograph. The official waved his arms and said, what if everybody did that? When I came home, I gave my mom a hug. What if everybody did that? Everybody should. So now it's time to stop and think and come up with some questions for your teacher. What happened in each of those scenes when somebody didn't follow the rules? Think about that, talk to your teacher and come up with some really good questions.